Hey guys, this is Lego Dude here, and today's video I am bringing you guys another war machine. Now this one is really special because it is my first navy build. So it is well, I I have built other boats before, but this is my first one that is for my military. So as you can see, it is a boat. And this is one of those Lego hulls that um, can float in water, so it's pretty cool. I'm guessing that if you put it in like a sink or a bathtub, it would float. So yeah, that's pretty cool. But also, another thing that's cool, and I think a, a, a few of my, I think my, I know my first video, I mentioned it, but this one... This is actually was a Lego set. It was this one. And as you can see, let me just go like that. You can see that it's very different, but some of the parts are the same. So basically, I took this design here from yet another Lego build and I kind of modified it a little bit. I made it a little bit bigger and everything. Um but yeah, so that's kind of how I got the whole idea. And then you have a motor motor on the back. And that's why there's this the design here. And if you take off the motor, there's that. So this here has a I have a crew of three. I have my driver guy in there. Let me get him, show him. There he is in there. Then you have your machine gunner. Sorry, I have to spin this around a lot. It's just, it's also wobbly. I don't know why. So then you have your machine gunner right here, and you have your other gunner for this large gun. So this is, I guess, it, it's like a small flat gun, anti aircraft, or could be anti ship. You just go like fire it towards another little patrol boat. So yeah, this is also, it's like a patrol boat, kind of. So I'm going to take these guys out. The uh, driver, he's not in the way of anything, except there is a there is a steering wheel in there. Kind of see that there. You can see that. There's a steering wheel in there, but that's pretty much it for inside. <clears throat> so <clears throat> this gun, the anti-air gun, it can go pretty far elevation, and it has inside the boat it has good ele or depression. I just bring that out here. You can see it has decent depression and obviously let me just show you that's how it is mounted on there on one of those spinny things so it has 360 degree spin which is pretty cool then I have a brick arms M60 I have these in my brick arms one of my brick arms videos I think it's the only one I gotta do a few more of those though so I've had several more orders so there's the Brick Arms Fabulous M60, and I have two mounts for it on either side. So if the bad guys are on this side, they would just keep it here and shoot them, go bang, 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 and get them. And then if they go to the other side, you know, just pull it off, and there goes the magazine. And then, oh, that wasn't supposed to happen. And then just mount it on there. Where'd it go? There, there it is. Okay, so here's the magazine. I'll just leave it there. So anyway, that's the features for the guns. Then you have your two. You have your um, starboard, starboard, or starboard and port lights here. Then you have them also up here. So that's how you tell that. You have your little white light in the front, and you also have, or I have, lots of these spotlights up here for seeing at night and stuff. So, I believe this wraps this video up, and I hope you have enjoyed this video. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoy watching this video. It's a lot, or it's a little quicker and shorter than my other videos, some of my other videos. So yeah, I hope you have enjoyed watching. Please subscribe for more content like this. Leave a like and leave a comment for what I should do. So yeah, have a nice day. Let your dude out.